At the start of the movie, we are shown a girl. Her name was Zoe. Zoe was going to meet her fiancé. Her mother gives her a car through which she can go there. Her mother asks her to be careful and says goodbye to her. Zoe says to her mother don't worry about me, I will reach there. Zoe was happy and was very excited to meet her fiancé. She likes to take selfies. That's why she takes a selfie after some time and sends it to her fiancé. To tell him her location, that where she is. During the journey, she meets an old man who was selling handmade things. After seeing those things Zoe set on her journey. During the driving, she was using mobile due to which she loses her attention from the road. During this suddenly an injured man comes in front of her car. That's why Zoe applies to brake immediately. Due to it, that man survives. As Zoe sees outside, she sees that man falls down. Then she sees that a gang was chasing the other man badly. Those people of the gang killed that man while rushing the car on him brutally. Now they were moving towards Zoe. Zoe wanted to help that injured man who was on road. That's why she hurriedly moves out from the car and put that man in her car. She was about to run from there, but then the gang arrive there. They hold Zoe and start teasing her. Then they in front of her eyes kill that injured man badly. They were teasing Zoe a lot. Due to is, she runs from there. But then the leader of that gang named Trey points Zoe. The bullet shoots on Zoe's leg. Due to it Zoe falls down immediately. Then they take her with them and tie her with the bed. Then they torture her a lot and it was done bad with her. Zoe was feeling much pain. On the other side Zoe's fiancé was worried about Zoe. That it is too late and she hadn't returned home yet. That's why he sees the last picture sent by Zoe. There was a board visible in that picture because of that board he finds Zoe's last location. He immediately calls police and asks them to search Zoe. On the other side the leader of gang Trey was still torturing Zoe. Trey tells that I am grandson of that man who finished a tribe from America. He also shows her the cut off heads of the members of that tribe. Those were turned into skeletons. He says that those were their heads who were killed by my grandfather. He picks a skull among those skulls. He tells Zoe that this is the skull of the leader of that tribe. He was a commander. Hearing it and seeing those skulls Zoe gets scared, actually Trey was telling truth about his forefathers. Then the gang drank and they were enjoying themselves. Meanwhile, a man of the gang says that we should kill Zoe now. That man was actually Trey's friend. Trey says that I want to torture Zoe more. That's why you will not kill her now. On it they bet with the help of cards. So, Trey's friend wins this bet and that's why he goes to kill Zoe with a knife. On the other side Zoe somehow, after bearing a lot of pain releases herself hardly. She begins to run from there, but Trey's friend sees her. He holds Zoe and stabs her with a knife several times. Due to it Zoe dies there. Then that old man who was selling things, he was walking with his dog. Then he finds the dead body of Zoe. He lifts her dead body and takes her at his location. He makes a medicine after mixing some herbs and putting it on her wound. Here we come to know that old man belonged to that tribe that was finished by Trey's grandfather. Then that old man performs a ritual while seeing some magic spells. To bring Zoe's soul back in her body, during it Zoe's body starts flying in the air. There was actually a soul came in her body. Zoe's face had become horrible means her eyes were turned black. Then she attacks that old man. But that old man makes Zoe faint soon. Zoe's fiancé also arrives there and he stays in a hotel. Then we are shown Zoe, when she comes into her senses, she comes into the city area. There she sees a public telephone, then she calls her fiancé from that phone. She tells him that I am alive and I am safe and sound. Zoe's fiancé becomes happy after listening to her voice. He also takes out the location of that public phone. Then he moves to that location. Then Zoe sees a police officer she moves forward to take help from him. But then she saw that the police officer was none other than a man of that gang. Seeing him Zoe gets aggressive. That's why she reaches at a club while following him. That member of the gang was shocked to see Zoe. Eyes of Zoe becomes black again. It seems that there is again that soul arriving in her body. Here the gang member, the friend of Trey attacks Zoe. But before he attacks Zoe, Zoe blasts his belly. She kills him while taking out all his intestines. Then a fighter tries to shoot Zoe with a gun. But Zoe makes him faint while hitting him with a chair. When Zoe's fiancé reaches at that public telephone place, he sees police there. He asks about Zoe from the police. On it, that police officer says that there was held a murder of a man. The person you are searching for, he is not here. Zoe's fiancé tells that police officer that my fiancé had called me one hour before from this place. 
on which that police officer says okay all right I will handle your case later. Then Trey also arrives there with his gang. After seeing his friend's dead body he becomes furious. He could not understand that who had killed his friend. Then Zoe's fiancé goes to them. He shows them Zoe's picture and asks them that have you seen this girl? When they see Zoe's picture, they ask him to leave from there immediately. But when Zoe's fiancé tells them that she called me one hour before from here. Hearing it, they all get surprised. They move forward to kill Zoe's fiancé. But then the police officer arrives there and asks them to leave from there. When Zoe comes into her senses, she finds herself in a shed. Then a door of a room opens automatically. There were every kind of tools in that room. Zoe picks an arrow and a bow, and she leaves from there. Then that gang's people go to that place where they bury Zoe. They see that the dead body of Zoe was not there. They think that where's that dead body gone? Where can it go? Then that colleague who killed her says that maybe some wild animal took her body. Because it is impossible that the person killed by me survives. But Trey does not believe in it. Then they plan to move far from their houses because of the fear of the police. That maybe police arrest them. That's why they go to their homes and begin to pack their luggage. But when one of Trey's friend comes out of his house. He sees that someone had thrown arrows at his car. Seeing it, Tret's friend gets frightened and he leaves a voice not for him. He tells him that I am feeling that girl around me. Meanwhile Zoe arrives there and starts killing him with arrows. She shoots him many arrows. She shoots arrows until he dies. After it when Trey hears his friend's message he immediately goes there. Seeing there he sees that someone had killed his friend. Then Zoe sees that her body is being rotting and there were insects in her body. Seeing it Zoe goes to that old man and asks its solution from him. Then that old man makes her understands that actually he found her body from the grave. You were dead when I found you. So I performed a ritual and called your soul back. But at that time with your soul one more soul came in your body. That soul was none other than of that commander who was the leader of that tribe. Leader's soul wanted to take revenge for many years. That leader's soul wanted to take revenge from that whole family after finishing them. The family who killed their tribe, and these are the people who have done wrong with you means Trey's family. It means leaders and your enemy are same. That old man also tells Zo that your body is rotting and we have a short time. So, we have to do something soon. On the other side Trey was making plan to kidnap Zoe's fiancé. So that Zoe could not harm them. She will not harm them. Zoe's fiancé was weeping while missing her, and he was very sad. Then Trey and his companions arrived there, and they beat him badly. Then they lifted him, put him in their car, and were going from there. But when they were leaving from there Zoe arrives there. She shoots an arrow on the neck of Trey's friend. Due to it, he gets injured, and he starts bleeding. Then Trey and his friend gets shocked after seeing Zoe alive. They run from there, Zoe also runs from there and jumps on their car. There Zoe and Trey's friend fights. Trey's friend stabs Zoe several times. But it did not affect Zoe. Zoe was about to kill Trey's friend, but then Trey applies break. Due to it Zoe falls down in front of the car. Trey crushes Zoe several times with the car, but it was useless. Trey gets shocked after seeing that how is she still alive. He does not waste time to think about it, he runs from there, while saving his life. That takes Zoe's fiancé at a place and tie him. Trey's companion who was injured, because of the arrow, was still in pain. They were not taking that friend to the hospital. Trey's friend was telling him that, when I saw eyes of Zoe, those were black. It seems like there's a soul in her. Hearing it Trey says that I know about an old man. He lives at the place where you buried Zoe. Maybe he had done this, and he called any soul in Zoe's body. The secret thing is that old man belongs to that tribe. Then we see that Trey hires a lot of men. They were having a lot of guns. On the other side Zo was binding her body with a tape. And she was sad. But then there the soul of that leader means the soul of commander arrives. He gives two weapons to Zo which they used in the war. Now the night falls and the injured friend of Trey was feeling pain. He wanted to go hospital now. He secretly moves from there in a car to go to the hospital. Then suddenly Zo comes in front of his car. She throws a rod towards him. Due to it the car loses its control and turns, with it one more friend of Trey dies. On the other side Trey was telling everything to Zo's fiancé. That how they all had done wrong with his fiancé. They torture her a lot. Hearing it Zo's fiancé feels very bad and he starts weeping. After it when Trey sees Zo, he alerts his companions. But Zo was killing everyone one by one. Later it Trey was searching for his friend, but he comes to know that Zoe had killed him too. But then Zoe takes hid friend's heart in front of him 
She eats in front of his eyes. Seeing it he gets scared and comes outside while running. Going outside he sees a police officer. He kills that police officer and runs from there. Then Zo goes to her fiancé, her fiancé weeps a lot after seeing her. Zo's fiancé asks Zo to stay near him. But Zo has short time to take revenge. She leaves from there because she wanted to take her revenge. Then Trey comes to that old man and asks him that tell me how Zo becomes alive? On it, that old man tells him everything. He also tells Trey that now the tribe leader's soul is present in Zo. That soul will relax after finishing your whole family. Hearing it Trey asks him that how to get rid from that soul. On it that old man says that you have to burn the skull of that leader. Doing this his soul will leave Zo's body. Then police find Zo's fiancé, they make him release from that place and investigates him. Zo reaches at Trey's house and she sees that Trey's brother had committed suicide. Then the soul of that tribe's leader kill Trey's mother. And that soul leaves from there. Then Trey reaches at a place after taking all skulls. But there wasn't the skull of the tribe's leader. Then Zo arrives there, she had her skull of that tribe's leader. Seeing her Trey gets surprised and to save his life he takes out a chainsaw and starts fighting. Zo cuts a hand of Trey and Trey stabs that chainsaw in Zo's body. After it Zo cuts Trey's neck. Due to it finally Trey also dies. Here the revenge of Zo and that leader completes. After some time, Zo's fiancé also comes there. Because that old man called him there. He sees the half part of Zo's body in the grave, he says to Zo that I love you so much. After it he burns Zo's body. With it Zo and that leader's soul got peace. Because their revenge was completed. Here Zo's fiancé does not know anything that what was happening there. Then that old man tells him everything that what had happened with Zo. He also tells that why she killed them. Here this movie ends, thanks for watching.